hello 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 guys welcome back again to my youtube channel this is sports payouts if you just joining me do wait to hit the like button hit the subscribe button and don't forget to turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos because on a regular basis i will be dropping different betting strategy for you guys you can do well to check the description i will leave the link to my telegram group so that whenever i drop any updates or any vip application you'll be among the first set of people to see it all right so on this video i'll be making a prediction on the bodesliga league okay so starting from uh, bayern munich against stuttgart I'm gonna make our prediction live and also guys you can do where to stick everything or you just pick two or three matches from this prediction or you can change some of my predictions all right so we have the bayern munich against stuttgart so when we check their table you see that bayern munich they have 11 points compared to stuttgart that has just four points so you know very well this season bayern munich they are always scoring a lot of goals in their matches so for bayern munich this is their result of their last five matches these guys they always score in their in their matches okay so you take note of that they always play over 1.5 in their matches okay so when we go over to stuttgart you see that these guys um they've drawn three times they've lost one and they've won just one but for bayern munich they've won three times they've uh, drawn twice so these guys they've not lost any match in their in their last five matches so for their head to head matches against each other so uh, they played match uh, against each other in may 8th of may so they played a draw 2-2 Okay, so in 2021, the uh, Bayern Munich played 5-0, 4-0. So, this is it, guys. Um, there's no need of you picking a straight win for this particular prediction. You can pick this particular prediction as over 1.5. Pick this prediction as over 1.5 to be on the safer side. So, we'll go back to the next one, which is Frankfurt against Wolfsburg. So, um, let's check their table. So as you can see, uh, none of them is among the first nine. So for Frankfurt, they are number 10 on the table with 8 points. While Wolfsburg, they have just 2 points and they are number 17 on the table. So you can see that uh, the difference between them is just 6 points. So for the head-to-head -head statistics, guys, take a good look at this. Um, they've won twice for Frankfurt, they've drawn twice, and they've lost once okay so for wolfsburg they've lost three times and they've drawn twice all right so this is it this is their prediction so their head-to-head -head statistic against each other you see that wolfsburg they always score in their matches and these guys always play over 1.5 in their matches all right they always play over 1.5 so guys pick this particular prediction as uh, over 1.5 so the next one which is hertha berlin against um Leverkusen. So let's check their table. So, guys, as you can see, these guys they are going hand in hand with each other. Okay, Hertha Berlin has 13 points. Sorry, they have four points, and Bayer Leverkusen has three points. So, um, let's check their head to head statistics. For Hertha Berlin, you see that these guys they've lost three of their last five matches, they've won one and they've drawn just one. Okay, so for Leverkusen, they've lost four of their matches. They've won just one, okay, just one, and they've lost four. So these guys, when you check their head to head, you see that these guys, they always play over 1.5 in their matches. They always play over 1.5, okay? So guys, this is it, this is it. But my advice for this particular prediction is um, you pick this particular prediction as first half under 2.5. To be on the safer side these guys they can't score up to three goals in their first half so just pick this match first half on that 2.5 so the next one which is hoffenheim against means so um let's check their table you see that maze is number fifth on the table with 10 points and hoffenheim uh number seven on the table with nine points so they are head to head statistics for hoffenheim they've lost twice Yes, they've lost twice and they've won three times in their last five matches. For mains, they've lost just once, they've won three times and they've drawn just once. So, okay, our main concern is their, their matches being played against each other. So, in February, they played against each other and mains won. So, as you can see, since um, 2021, 
to date, Mays has always been taking a lead against these guys. So, they barely score a lot of goals in their matches, okay? They don't score more than three goals. So, that's why we are going to pick our prediction for this match as first half under 2.5. They are not going to score up to three goals in their first half. So, um, the okay, is it the fourth one or the fifth one? Let me say against Dortmund. So, let's check their table. So, as you can see, Dortmund already has 12 points. They have 12 points and they're number second on the table. Then for Lipnitz, they have 5 points. Alright, so they have 5 points um, on the table and they're number 11 on the table. So when you check their heads to head statistics, you see that um, for Lipnitz, they always play over 1.5. They always play over 1.5, over 2.5, over 3.5. For Dortmund, these guys, they've won 4 of their last matches and they've lost just 1. So they are head to head matches against each other. These guys are always playing both teams to score. They always score against each other. Okay, they always score against each other. So guys, um, you can pick this particular prediction as um, over one point five. Pick this prediction as over one point five. So we'll go back to the last one, which is shake against a bochum. So, when you check the table, you see that Bochum, they are the last on the table with no point, while Sheik has just three points. So, um, let's go over to their head-to-head -head statistics. Yes, take a good look at Sheik results in their last five matches. They've drawn three times and they've lost twice. So, these guys, they also play over 1.5 in their prediction. While for Bochum, they've lost all, all five of their last five matches. They've lost all, okay? They've lost all. So, for their head-to-head -head matches, the last time they played was in 2020. By uh, Sheik beating these guys, Terry goes to nil. Okay, as you can see, they always play over 1.5. So, guys, you can pick this particular prediction as um, Sheik to score. Sheik is going to score at least one goal in this match. Alright, so you pick Sheik to score. So, guys, um, I've come to the end of this video. You can do where to pick at least three or four matches, or you can stake everything in a single ticket. All right. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video.